Trump will make an announcement today ending the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals program known as DACA. The program started under President Obama. You might uh, hear people uh, covered under DACA referred to as Dreamers. It allows undocumented immigrants who came to the U.S. as children to stay, but that could change. Just a few hours ago, New York City's mayor announced on Twitter he will sue if President Trump follows through with it. Tri-state DACA recipients, though, are concerned that they could be sent back to their home countries. Not on your side's TJ Parker is live downtown, where a rally actually will be held a little bit later on today. TJ? Yeah, and Chris, several tri-state organizations will meet here outside the Scripps Center, outside of Senator Rob Portman's office to rally to protest the end of DACA. As you had mentioned, you know, President Trump will make that announcement to end the program sometime today. There are around 800,000 people across the country who are DACA recipients under this program. There have been several demonstrations like the one that is supposed to take place this afternoon across the country leading up to the president's announcement. U.S. White House officials say the president is leading toward phasing out the program over the next six months to let Congress come up with legislation to replace it. There are several solutions in the works, including the DREAM Act, which would allow undocumented minors to obtain conditional residency with a chance of obtaining permanent residency if qualifications are met. 21-year-old Mauricio Vivar shared his thoughts on DACA with me. He's part of the program and came to the U.S. from Mexico when he was just five years old. We're hoping that this isn't going to be a negative impact, but if it is, we'll be ready to push the DREAM Act even more than it is so right now. Whether or not this situation goes positive or negative, I still have to keep going with my life. I can't just let one obstacle, you know, detain me from achieving what I want to do in my life. Yeah, there's no word yet when President Trump will make his announcement today. Uh, today's rally here at the Scripps Center will take place at 4.30 this afternoon. We have reached out to Senator Rob Portman for comment, and we are expected to hear from him sometime later today as well. We're live downtown. I'm TJ Parker, 9 on your side. 535.